I've got an internet crush She's not a celebrity, but she's taken So can I fall in love? You guys, long time no see. I am so excited to be back with another video. This one, I feel like I've been waiting to do this because I wanted to give it enough time for me to come to my full conclusions and opinions about this, but I feel like now I can finally shut up about it because in my previous videos, I've been nonstop talking about wanting an aura ring and I finally got it. But I actually had a good reason to because I think you guys have seen this before in my old videos. I had this like cheap $15, $20 watch from Amazon that I would wear every single day and it would only track my steps and if you like walked or ran and I don't really do that. Um, it wasn't really valuable in other aspects but it kept breaking like the hinges broke off and everything and i would super glue it together or do anything in my power just to keep it together so i wouldn't have to buy an aura ring and finally it just broke after i super glued it back together like three times and then my boyfriend was like it's time to just you know buy your ring and i was like okay honestly i've been going through a lot i'm like so stressed out with school because my professor is just being I can't even talk about it because I don't want her to sue me for defamation. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Anyways, so like the title said, today I will be giving you a full review of the Aura Ring. The one that I got is this one. And it's the Gold Horizon. Therefore, that means it's circular all around. I just thought that the gold would look better in what I you know, wear every day. So that was my deciding factor of that. And I got it in a size nine when your body heats up you know your your fingers kind of expand and so these are like sixes my my middle fingers are like sixes and then this is like in seven eight but i actually got this in a nine because my fingers are different chubbiness so this one was like the best option for me it comes in this cute little box and when you open it the ring would be laying right here and also in that comes the charger i obviously have the charger and the cord out right now because i was just charging my ring um it doesn't come with this this came with our iphone comes right in here and in it it also comes with instructions this is just what the cord was wrapped in it's just cardboard that you can toss but i wanted to keep it for this video to show you guys all the good stuff inside it and then at the bottom is just a manual so if you look at the design of the ring too it's a the complete circle i know there are some that has like the flat edge but i thought the circle one would just fit me better um and it's really easy to see that at the bottom of the ring there's like this little indicator indent here and that's how i know that that should be at the bottom of my finger because that is where the sensors are i don't know if you can see them right there with the aura you have to download an app so i find that every morning i wake up constantly checking my app i never check my socials anymore like twitter tiktok instagram all of that because it gives you a sleep score so i'm constantly just like in a competition with myself every morning it'll say like your sleep score which i will show you guys and get into it more and then it kind of shows you like the graph of how well you've slept and if you slept well or w what times you slept in a deep sleep in a REM sleep in a light sleep i don't know if any of you guys can relate to me maybe it's just me because i know my sleep schedule is really weird but i used to be one of those people where i could go out until like three in the morning and then wake up at 5 45 to go to work but i felt like that was normal to me but obviously i know that that's not healthy and it's not sustainable for your body a lot of that time i was going out with my friends and you know drinking and hanging out another reason why i decided to get this ring was because i am not a big watch wearer or bracelet person this one is a permanent one that i got with my best friend a while ago and it hasn't bothered me i'm trying to get in bracelets more because i think they're cute but 
the watch specifically i just could not do it like i told you guys i had that amazon one and it just refused it just bothered me so much i did not like it i didn't like the look of it and my one of my biggest pet peeves you guys who are like wedding vibes being a guest at weddings and wearing this big fat apple watch like i saw this girl go to prom and she had like that apple watch on her wrist and i just was like no it totally ruins the look just my personal opinion but if that's your vibe i'm totally down for that you do you but for me it just never worked well for me or i never liked that so the aura ring was my best bet especially because it's so aesthetically pleasing you guys can ask anyone i know i'm a ring girl until i die i love rings usually i have like rings well i try not to overdo it because it looks so messy but i always have rings on my fingers so so without me rambling on and on let's just get into this review i was doing a lot of research on this ring deciding if i wanted it or not and it just kept pushing me more and more and more so this is going to be the video of what you need to know if you want to buy this ring so like i said it's extremely aesthetically pleasing it's nice to look at it's big and chunky it doesn't ruin your look um you know you obviously wear this to sleep too and trust me you guys you don't even feel it. What I will say first is this ring is super, super lightweight. I never even notice it there versus a watch. Another great thing about this ring is that the battery is extremely long lasting. I think this lasts me maybe like five, six days. And considering that it's, you know, always on, always tracking, always looking at your body temperature and stuff, I would say that is such great battery percentage um and especially when i do need to charge it i honestly charge it in like different increments so like i work out every single day and every time i take a shower um i put my watch on the ring charger and then i just go about my shower even though you can bring this in the water i usually don't because i don't want it to tarnish or anything and i'm just kind of extra extra careful with this especially because i paid a lot of money for this to eat your own though do what you want with your ring but just for my own comfort and anxiety i don't shower or do anything with this okay another great thing is that this ring tracks your period so in the app it'll show you exactly what your body temperatures are like if you're kind of moody also if you're feeling sick i think a couple days ago i was feeling a little warm and almost running a fever it literally told me that it's time to rest because it could since that my body temperature was rising i did have this for at least one cycle and i was able to go in there and track and put in my like oh this is where my flow is like really heavy my flow was a little lighter and then it tracks the period cycle which is when you're not on your period like when you're not bleeding um how many days it is and then your body temperatures will regulate with that so i think that's such a great essential tool especially because i have an irregular period i think that's the right term with it because i know people have irregular periods where they won't have their periods for like a couple months and then they will have their periods for like three straight months because of that that's not what i have i would just say my period happens every month but it varies so for example my period could be like the first week of january and my month cycle will go and then in february i won't get my period until maybe like the second or third week of february obviously everyone's body's a little different but it's never consistent the ring also tracks your daytime stress and i feel like i'm always go 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 because i love that fast-paced atmosphere but it's good to know when i'm doing too much and i think that's also something that i need to work on personally i'm always feeling like i need to do more with so much that i i have so much time so why am i not spending it working or you know expanding my knowledge and then this ring will also tell me when it's time to go to bed with the aura ring you're tracking three most important things which is your readiness your sleep and your activity those are the three things that you're kind of looking for and this was something that helped me decide if i wanted this aura ring i'll talk about this in the cons too but it doesn't track all your workouts but for me that's not something that i care about necessarily um it does count your steps which i love but it's not going to be tracking your workouts it does allow you to like input your workouts so it'll track if i go on my app 
I already, not here because I already did it, but it'll say like, oh, were you working out during this specific time frame? And then you can click if you were dancing, walking, cycling. It'll give you a list of options, but for the most part, all I do is walk and weight lift. So it, would, it wouldn't track my weight lifting. So yesterday, I got a sleep score of 84 and it'll show me right here what my optimal score is 84 which is considered good but you want to get crowned if your sleep is extremely good you'll get a crown let me see if i can find an example okay so the night before i got great sleep my sleep was at a 94 and i got a crown with it and this is what i'm talking about where my competitiveness comes because every morning i wake up i look to see what my score is and if i topped yesterday's if i got a crown if i slept bad which for the most part i feel like it really depends on what i'm doing during the day it's really hard for me to get my sleep perfect every single time but that is just something that I thought was super important for me to learn about. We can also look at our readiness scores and this will just track your heart rate, your BPMs and show you what exactly you're working with. And then I love that it has the charts on there too so you can see it shows you specifically like what categories you're working with and if it's good, optimal, need some improvement. On my phone, on my page, yes, this is a picture of mona patel's met dress because she looked phenomenal and i love this dress for inspiration but i have the aura step tracker right here as a widget for my lock screen and then it's easy for me to just click on it like so click on it let me put my face in and it opens up to tell me exactly what my stats are for the day and i check this quite frequently now that we've said all of the pros, I think it's time for us to move on to the cons, which there aren't many, but I think they should be highly noted if you're considering buying this ring. So the first thing that I want to talk about with this ring is obviously the price. I think I bought this for $4.99 just base price, but then obviously the price raises depending on what warranty you get with it that's something that i didn't really like i felt like it wasn't worth the 570 something dollars and i've already seen some dupes for this like literally i think it's called the ev ring it looks exactly like this except there's like a slit right here opening i looked that one up and the price is definitely a lot cheaper considering this is basically almost six hundred dollars after taxes after all that it's a big downfall on top of the price with this ring you also have to pay a monthly subscription yes you heard that correctly a monthly subscription i think that's just absolutely bizarre you can use the ring without the monthly subscription but of course the monthly subscription is the thing that gives you all the perks like your tracking of your period and whatnot of that that's something that honestly turned me away from it but after a long debate i just told myself that i would make it worth it the monthly subscription is about like i think it's six or seven dollars which isn't a lot but it adds up it's how they make their money i should say so that's another downfall with this ring that i honestly am a little irritated with but it's fine, you know, you can always make more money. That's what I keep telling myself and that it's okay. Another thing that I'm super extremely cautious about with this ring is scratching it. I am absolutely paranoid because considering how much I paid for this, I want it to last. Like, I'm so terrified that it's just gonna scratch and just ruin it. So it is absolutely perfectly fine right now the reason why it's fine is because i invested in some ring coverings and this one's just a silicone rubber one that i got from amazon i'll link it below but i know they have other colors too like black white pink i decided to go with the transparent one and i always put this on when i'm working out specifically when i'm weight training because I don't want the bar to scratch this down here and like I showed you guys you know there's that little indent to indicate that it goes on the bottom but I'm terrified of scratching this especially because it was so freaking expensive so as you can see it fits perfectly 
in the ring and it looks just like this except <laughs> it looks kind of ugly okay these were really inexpensive considering i got two of them for like i think i got it for like eight bucks so four dollars a piece is not that bad considering i wear it literally every day when i work out so my biggest fear with that too is i don't want this to tarnish it is water resistant and i've seen that you could wear this in the shower when you're washing your hands which when i'm washing my hands i will just do a quick little rinse and whatever but when i'm showering i never take this with me i always put this in the charger when i'm in like my 15 minute shower and that will almost fully charge my watch for me which i think is super convenient my overall thoughts on this if you want to buy it or if you're thinking about purchasing it i would highly recommend for me i think there's a lot more pros than cons with this ring every time i'm with family or friends and they all talk about like tracking their fitness to watch i always get to hop in the conversation and tell them about my beautiful ring and they definitely get super intrigued on what it is and all want to try it on so i've been influencing people before i've been influencing people <laughs> i'm just kidding but i would highly recommend i think this is such a great tool to use it's so easy to use i feel like i could live with this forever um i don't know what it is with like upgrading because it's not like an iphone like an iphone i always use my phones until they're absolutely dead i really i want new phones but i control my intrusive thoughts and i always keep them until they're on their last leg so i'm kind of curious if this ring is the same deal if you just use it until it's on its very last leg or if you need like a sizing difference um i'm hoping this will last extremely long term maybe that will be a video in like five years <laughs> but anyways i would highly recommend this ring if you're looking for something extremely lightweight fitting and for light activity thank you guys so much for watching i know i've been mia for so long but trust me there's more to come i feel like my summer is just so packed with things i'm gonna try my best to get everything on video i'm in this like developing stage of blossoming i feel like there's been a lot of negative energy around me and just my life and now i'm ready to just like step back out just a lot of things are happening i'm super excited to share with you guys so stay tuned for that but again thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and to like this video so i hopefully will see you guys very soon bye <laughs>